Welcome along. Happy Monday. Um, my name's Jackie. If you don't already know me, I am here for you every Monday and Wednesday. If you haven't subscribed already, please do so. And if at the end you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. So today's video is a bit of an Amazon haul, but centered all around the kitchen. I have found some amazing deals on Amazon, and they're all things that I've either they look amazing or they've made life easier or contributed in some way. So I thought you'd love them too. Um, so if you haven't already, go and get a coffee or in my case, a lemon water, get cozy and come on. to talk about is this chopping board now you know how people have started um putting sets of chopping boards on the side it's an aesthetic thing rather than a functional thing i will never use this chopping board but it's personalized and it's so like it's not um bumpy or anything like that and it's so lovely it's such good quality and the look of it the real wood and stuff I absolutely love this and as you can see it looks lovely with the other sets I've switched it up with different but not matching different um, chopping boards and I just think aesthetically speaking it is beautiful what do you think? and how cute how cute is my chopping board set up and that little personalization just set it off I think so the next thing I want to speak about is this utensil jug now you could have any utensil jug. I had all my utensils in the drawer and it was so annoying. Now with this, with this jug, I can have this jug right next to the cooker. And because it looks pretty as well, it just goes so well and it's so easy to reach and grab. And it's big enough that basically I can have all the utensils I want. I like the cream colour and I don't know if you can see. Oh. I don't know if you can see that, but it says utensils here. Um, and I have got lots of utensils in here. And loads of space for lots, lots more. Um, it's not expensive. It's not a big deal, but it just makes such a difference to cooking experience, I guess you want to say. I love it. There's the utensils um, jug. And I can just be, as I'm cooking, grab whatever I need. It's just so effective next you would not believe how high and low i searched for a gold knife and knife block set i couldn't find them anywhere eventually though i went on amazon and i found this how gorgeous is that and the knives well how fab i love this and like again just looks so sleek and sophisticated. I could make more noise if you want. It just looks so sleek and sophisticated and the colour, it matches perfect. It just looks so lovely up against everything else. It's like very functional, obviously, um, and every knife you could want. But at the same time, you don't have to compromise on style because it goes so well. They do have different colours in this. So when I link it, um, you'll be able to see all the different colours. Um, the block is like corrugated something. <laughs> I don't know what it is. Corrugated, so you just, it's not, it's not wood. Um, there was some gold ones, but they were more like, you know, the 
so you can see the whole knife the thing was clear and i didn't like that it just didn't go with the vibe i was looking for at all i couldn't be more happy with the choice i made and then obviously the knives they just go so well don't they next not pretty but still incredibly functional are these these are roaster mats they're just so practical i use these not instead of the tray but instead of the tin foil and you can throw them in the dishwasher i mean ugh. they're just so practical and like i don't know i don't know is tin foil bad for the environment either way it's not good for the purse is it if you can have something else and just wash them and go um I love them. I use them for I, I use them to lay them on a tray if I'm making chips, cookies, literally anything. But these are just so perfect, practical. And that's what we like. Oh, and also inexpensive, even better. Next, practicalness crossed with pretty. It's um, these bamboo drawer separators. Now, I, for the longest time, had, you know, the, I don't know what you call it, the sectional things, what you stick in the drawer, and you always get bits in them, and they just look awful. And then they don't ever take up the full drawer, so you've got that little bit next to your drawer that just gets full of, like, candles and... Birthday candles. And... The little whisks that you, you get for Christmas with the hot chocolate cups. What else? What else? Lighters. Tin openers. Oh, all kinds. But then, then things go to the back. So when you need them, you haven't got them, you buy some more. It's, it's a thing. So anyway. And they don't look pretty. So i seen these on Amazon. Again, relatively inexpensive. Um, and I think you got, I can't remember if it was four or six in a pack. And because the spaces and you do each one yourself, you can see how big the gap is that you want. So for me, I have got these in two drawers. I've got one with knives, forks, spoons, little spoons, sharp steak knives. And then all my other bits, because I've got like, you know, the bit that I was just talking about, that bit. Um, and then in the other drawer, um, all my other knives but i'll show you and you'll see what i mean but these are i don't know why they just look so good so they are one of my favorite <laughs> one of my favorite amazon finds they just look so professional like professional drawers if you get what i mean <laughs> you know what i mean and to go within them professional drawers with my aesthetic i needed gold cutlery how gorgeous is that so these were a steal on amazon and don't they just look look at them don't they look lovely i mean you feel bougie eating your porridge or whatever they are and they just set everything up so well expensive but in the world of covid i was willing um i've got one of these in the kitchen and one in the bathroom and it is a paper towel dispenser i just hate the thought of not just for the guests but then afterwards so the thought of them like washing and drying their hands on either the tea towel or the bathroom towel it kind of knocks me sick a bit and then you go in later on and you use it and but anyway, it was making me a bit sick. I seen these on Amazon and I thought, you know what? I'm gonna have a go and I'll You don't need the same brand towels as you do for the dispenser, so you can hunt down the cheapest ones. And there you go, no more COVID. And not forgetting, these are recyclable. So as long as you recycle, you're all right, aren't you? 
you yeah, all right right this next thing you might think it's a bit silly but i got this notion that i liked ice balls you know the big ice balls instead of ice cubes or whatever yeah so i had a little hunt on um amazon and i found these and they make them like a diamond shape well not a diamond shape the round but like a crystal maze ball that's what they're like a crystal maze ball and they come like this with this little funnel so you put the funnel in the top and you put the water in and then you just put that in the freezer and then you open it up and there's a crystal maze ice ball in there it's not actual crystal maze obviously don't know if that i'm allowed to say that but um yeah so i've got one already made oh my god i feel like i'm on blue peter here's one i made earlier um, and you'll see it's just a bit of fun but they're really inexpensive and especially with new year and stuff now you want all the glitch you can get don't you so try them you'll love them one of the most requested bits of info i get asked on instagram is about these cups these are double walled mugs now i've got a clean one here because i am actually drinking up with this one now as you can see normally when you buy a double walled mug they're quite small and you can't fit a lot in them and i was just like this just isn't gonna do but they look so nice so i hunted down on amazon and i found these and these again not that expensive they come in twos so i just bought two sets if i put boiling water in this I, I can hold it like this and not feel it these are gorgeous you know if you like have lemon water like i do or if you make a hot chocolate and you've got layers so you've got your cream sprinkles you can see it all these are a hit an absolute hit and finally not a christmas find but i thought i can't go without showing you this because i think this makes a lovely little stocking filler and it's not expensive now mine is over the top it's this mine's over the top but that's because i have got car keys house keys my ear pod thing and key rings on there so mine's a bit over the top but with this it's like oh, any girl knows you know when you're trying to get in your car or you're pushing trying to, or you're holding the baby or anything like that at making sure it's got this card thing on it so you can put all your bank cards on there so technically speaking if i didn't want to if i was just shooting the shop i don't have to take a bag phone and that is all i need and i just go like and, and they come in all different styles but i i chose this one i bought a black and white one for my daughter but given that they're relatively expen inexpensive and you can add you can add to it so i think look it's even got a little tassel you've thought of everything i think this is gorgeous and i can't tell you out of everything here this this and these are probably my faves oh, i can't decide because i really like these as well and the ice balls i don't know i just love amazon i had to get up off the couch for this one. Oh, let me move back this is a dog caddy a uh, dog caddy as if a dog food caddy now i have as you know three dogs two large one little one i can't do that one little um and the dog food was getting beyond so i got this and you just to fill it up you do this comes with its own scoop but to use it every day you just lift this up and you just scoop it out but it just looks so much better than having bags of dog food or whatever all over the place don't you think <laughs> so there you have it guys there's everything i hope i have gave you something to think about something fabulous it's um it's been fun filming this hope you enjoyed it like i said if you, if you did enjoy it give it a thumbs up make sure you subscribe and let me know if you found anything amazing on amazon that you think i'd love it doesn't have to be kitchen all right guys see you on wednesday bye